Okay, so let's go back to integrations. Next, we're gonna do WordPress. Okay, so when I click here, I click on WordPress, right there is my company plugin. Okay, so if I copy that, so what we're gonna do now is go back to the website. We need to go to plugins. Again, we're gonna go to add new, and we're gonna search for CallRail. So here it is, here's their plugin for WordPress. Install now. Activate. Okay, now, once again, if I go into settings, so we're gonna do call rail, and remember this one right here, we took this and we copy it. We're gonna put it right here. Enable, save changes. It's been saved successfully. Okay, now let's go back here. Let's go back to our integrations, back to JavaScript. Let's start the test. I just added the URL for this landing page right here. And your code was uh, properly installed. So again, it works. You can run another test if you'd like. Oh, that, we're gonna, we still have that from before. It's not gonna change. Copy it. Open a new incognito window. Watch that number real quick. There it is. So it changed. Okay. So we've properly installed the, uh, the call rail plugin. Um, and then we're going to move on. If you found this helpful, if you like this content, please subscribe to this channel and give me a thumbs up. Um, please write me some comments too. If you have any questions, I'm happy to help. I really, I really enjoy doing this for some reason. It's a, uh, it really gets me all jacked up. So um, hope to see you in the next video. I'm going to have a lot more coming. Take care.